What's going on guys, Tiger here and I have some Madden 13 Ultimate Team coming at you guys. See here, I'm opening up my first ever pack. I never buy packs guys because usually when I want a card I just go out to auction block. But you know what, I had some coins and I felt like buying a pack. You know, you never know what you can get out of these silver packs. So far we got a fullback, 69 overall wide receiver, not going to use him. Halfback, we have Barry Sanders but he could be our third down. We have Eric Decker, Sean Smith, so some... Some good cards so far. So far, Taylor Mays, a card that I really like. I like Taylor Mays, and I got an 84 overall right guard, which is the highlight of the pack, in my opinion, because I need offensive linemen badly, guys. I can never get anything going with Barry Sanders, and there's no point in having a Hall of Fame running back as a player on your team if your offensive line is poop because he can never run the ball. So that's a huge upgrade right there. So we got a lot of good decent players out of this pack guys so it looks like I gotta start buying packs more often because Eric Decker he's definitely gonna fit in as our fourth wide receiver guys we can use him in four wide receiver set we got an upgrade at right guard guys um we got Sean Smith 79 overall cornerback I believe and that's a good upgrade from our starting quarterback currently and we got Taylor Mays who is a hard hitting strong safety guys I like doing a lot of safety blitz and packages and stuff a lot of plays like that, so definitely he uh, we can use him. He can hit people hard, and I like that about him. So we definitely got some good players out of that silver pack, and I got to start buying more silver packs, honestly, guys. More packs in general, because to this day, I've only bought him, like, less than five packs, to be honest, because whenever I want a card, I just go in the auction block, and if you guys don't like saving up for um packs because I can never save up for packs I always end up buying something with it I end up I always end up buying a card if you guys never want to do that this go on the auction block to be honest because you can find some good cards for real cheap and, uh, and later in this video I'll show you guys an example of that but you can definitely um get better cards for real cheap because people are sometimes are just like they really really want to sell a card and they want coins badly so they would do anything and even put up a real good card for a, a really cheap guy so yeah like I said go in the auction block just check it out go try it but I guess it's more of a challenge if you get all your cards from from packs but that's that's not how I want to play I don't know guys but a lot another thing I wanted to say in this video if you guys saw I picked up Mario banning him I actually did not record me picking him up but I only got him off the auction block because that's where I get all my cards of course for only about like 400 coins so Mario banning him is a good upgrade but you see here I got Brandon Lloyd guys for only 1500 coins like I said you can find a lot of good cards off the auction block for real cheap and I got Chris Clemens for 1500 coins guys so those are two plug and play starters right there that can definitely help out our team because our wide receiver core oh my god it's so much better now we only the, we used to only have one weapon which is Calvin Johnson but now we have Calvin Johnson starter Brandon Lloyd on the other side starter we have Mario Manningham in the slot we have Mohamed Sanu playing and we have Eric Decker guys so we have a lot of good wide receivers and our offense honestly is explosive we still have the captain card, Tom Brady. I'm looking to upgrade from that and get a different quarterback. But we have 85 overall, Tom Brady. We have 92 overall, running back, Hall of Fame running back, Barry Sanders, Calvin Johnson, Brandon Lord, Mario Manningham. And also on our defense, guys, I wanted to get Chris Clemens. I wanted a pass rusher coming off the edge, guys, someone that can just get to the quarterback because it seems like I can never put, put pressure on the quarterback unless I'm blitzing guys and I don't always want to blitz all the time so I wanted to get a good pass rusher and Chris Clemens was perfect I think 1500 for Brandon Lloyd and Chris Clemens um, is a steal in my opinion and both of those cards you would probably have to save up and get them in a gold pack for like 9000 and you can easily just go buy them as individuals off the auction box so yeah like I said if you guys don't know that method go check it out definitely but I'm changing up my depth chart right here my team is getting better and better the only part I do not like about my team currently is my offensive line to be honest because like I said earlier in the video I can never get anything going on the ground it seems like I can never run the ball because our offensive line cannot block honestly guys 
So that's why I went out and bought bought two new offensive linemen. I got Marik Pouncey, guys. Um, his yeah, Marik Pouncey, the center from the Pittsburgh Steelers, guys. I bought him off the auction block, nice 85 overall. And then I got this left guard from the Bengals. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce his name, but 285 overall centers, and I bought them for real cheap. I don't remember a price, but. Yeah, you guys, offensive linemen pretty cheap off the auction box, and now I should have better success running the ball. Also, I got Justin Tuck, and I got him for free, actually, guys. Another pass rusher I like. I got him for free from a Doritos bag. I bought a pack, a bag of Doritos, actually, and there's a code. I didn't even know about this, but there's a code for this free pack, and I typed in the pack, guys, and I ended up getting, like, the Giants Stadium, Giants Uniform, both which I'll never use, and I got Justin Tuck there, so I'm really excited about that. Two good pass rushers, so a lot of upgrades to my teams, guys, but if you guys missed my latest video, go check it out. It's the best catch in Man 13 ever. Calvin Johnson beats triple coverage, so if you guys want to go see that, check it out. My featured video is my Jamoris Keys vs. DeAnthony Thomas video and that video is a real good video please go check that out and follow me on twitter if you haven't at tigerxlr and subscribe if you want more thanks for watching guys and i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out